In this video, I'm going to show you how to install an electric powered designer radiator. This is a typical designer radiator, which has been converted to run off an electric element like this. We pre fill all the radiators with a glycol solution. Don't fill the radiators up anymore, as they need to be filled by 90% to allow 10% for expansion. Electric radiators work just as well as a standard central heating radiator. All you need is an electrical source. Electric pre-filled radiators can run off a 13 amp mains plug. If the installation is to be carried out in a bathroom or en suite, the electrical work must be carried out by a qualified professional. Before you start, you'll need to gather a few tools. An adjustable spanner, a tape measure, a spirit level, a pencil, a coilless drill, appropriate fixings depending on the wall material, and if required, a 13 amp plug. First you need to install the element. Do this by tipping the radiator on its side and removing the blanking cap from either of the bottom ends. Use an adjustable spanner, winding the element clockwise, but be careful not to over tighten as this may damage the rubber seal. Once you've done this, mark a centre line on the wall where you want the centre of the radiator to be. Measure the height between the top and bottom brackets. Work out how you want the radiator then mark the top and the bottom brackets in line with the centre line. Now you'll need to measure the width between the top brackets and the width between the bottom brackets. Half this measurement and draw a line across from the centre line. Now the wall is ready to be drilled or screwed. Fix the brackets in place and then hang the radiator. The radiator is now hung and can be wired up to the mains. If unsure how to connect or you're installing in a bathroom or en suite, then please consult a qualified professional. Thank you for watching another informative video by besteating.com. You can find us on all social media sites such as Twitter, YouTube and Facebook.